Hey guys, are you finding an indicator that will indicate the banker movement in trading view? So, in this video, as you can see, red color signifies that we can buy at red color, and also if green color are observed, means that we are going to have our position by stopping loss or even take profit based on the chart color. So basically, red color indicates banker movement means that banker has touched their initial plan of money movement into the chart and you can see when the red color go is going increasing in volume the chart also increasing in volume so in this video we are going to go through this indicator buy when red color start and also start to sell or take profit when green color are observed so let's start if you want to learn more using trading view and plot for your free graph using indicators you can check the description down below and start using trading view to start plotting your graph using your own strategy so let's start first of all as a disclaimer this tutorial is for educational purpose only and does not contain any constitute financial advice and in this video we are going to use smart macd mcdx Basically, this indicator will show the movement of banker and also retailer chip. And later, we will go through each of the definition of this indicator and we will try out optimize the best setting for this indicator. Lastly, we will stimulate how to use for this indicator and plot for our stimulation trial trade backtest. So, let's start. First of all, this indicator is by KGAP123, the author. Thanks for providing some such in, incredible indicator for us to track for banker movement. And later we will try out the indicator with optimized setting to provide a uh, insight using this indicator. We also will use additional indicator to support for trade. And also we are going to find out the trading strategy. We are going to determine its profit and loss. And we are going to use risk reward position to stimulate out the trading strategy. And we need to make sure that risk reward position is more than one so that we can have a reward bias trade. And as you can see here, when red color are formed means that banker inflow fund, green color means retailer inflow, and lastly, yellow means hot money, fast in, fast out money. We are going to define each of them later and make sure that you are watching this video to the end so that you can customize your own best strategy for your indicator. So let's start. First of all, you can open up this indicators at indicator step. Basically, you can just open smart MCDX and you can just open for this indicator by kgap123 and you can also add as framework for this indicator. If you want to learn more of this indicator, you can press the indicator's definition. Basically, it will show you the functionality, definition, and how to use this indicator. So we are going to go through the main point of this indicator. So basically, as this note, MCDS is an indicator based on specific formula to detect buyer and seller momentum. So as we are mentioned, red means buyer momentum green means seller momentum typically means that red we can buy green we start to take profit or decrease our position if we are planning for a long position and you can see the height of red bar more than 50 percent means that buyer is in control means that it can, you can plan for your trade and if green color means retailer yellow means hot money fast in fast out can make the money but need to be cautioned and plan for any stop loss or take profit price if you want to trade for any yellow hot money price. And red will be the banker chip and basically red increasing means that the chart will be a more bullish chart to be going upwards. So basically you can plan. And you can read through this by your own and later you can customize the setting based on the sensitivity default setting and also other setting you can go through this by yourself so let's start after i have opened smart macd you can open up any more indicator to support for your trading so basically 
I will use volume profile to indicate up my support resistance. High volume means that strong support or even strong resistance. So basically, I will use this to plot for my graph. And if you want to customize, you can just go to this and just change for the period of time, number of bars. So basically, I will choose 75 to suit for my trading strategy. You will consider the latest volume based on the chart. And also, Smart MACD also can customize. Basically, you can customize this to be a more sensitive or more long term. You can customize if you are if you are a swing trader, day trader, you can customize. Maybe swing trader will be a longer time period. But for day trader, intraday trader, or even scalping, you can just customize this based on your strategy. So after that, as you can see here, we will plot this up. So basically, you can see this area shows rate increasing and the chart also shows increasing. So if you are taking a position here, you can plot for your graph for a long position using this reward ratio. So for example, here will be an initial starting breakout based on volume. So basically you can see it as a breakout and you can plan your strategy to a higher value and the stop loss you also can customize your stop loss based on this as you can see here shows a very strong volume means that this is a very strong support for the fast in fast out so basically you can plan your risk ratio to be higher than one maybe 1.5 or even two or even higher so that you can make more risk reward ratio based on your strategy and make sure that you are disciplined on your take profit and cut loss point if you are planning for any protection or trading strategy so that you can make more risk reward based on the risk reward ratio protection you need to be obey to your stop loss this is one of the most important key note if you are planning for fast in fast out day trading intraday trading or even scalping trading so yeah basically that's all that's you can plan for this trade so let us find another point so for example at this point this point so at this point this area shows a lower end are going to increasing in momentum so basically this shows first it shows a strong breakout so basically this shows a strong breakout based on the previous support point so basically it shows a breakout and if you want to plan your position first you can just plan for a long position at this scenario so you can plan this position maybe at here So for a long position around here so for the target price you can refer previous area but if there is no previous support resistance you can opt for latest one so basically it will be here and for your cut loss will be at your nearest latest area so basically this is how you can plan for your trade if you are trading for a fast in fast out and make sure that you are punctual even though you are taking profit or even cut loss or short or long position so yeah basically that's all how you can plan based on banker momentum smart mcdx and you can also use other indicator as a support maybe you are you, you want to use for rsi to indicate the strength index you can use it to help as a support indicator to plan for strategy but not depending on only one strategy so yeah basically that's all how you can plan for your smart mcdx trading pattern make sure that you backtest all your trading strategy before you try any trading in the trading real world and if you want to customize your trading strategy you can maybe start thing to backtest using paper trading first before you try out in the real situation trading for fast and fast up so yeah, basically that's all for today's video. Thank you. If you like this video, you can just check for other video to learn more on trading. Thank you.